Hello, this is Mark Chen. I'm a professional photographer. One of my specialties is wedding photography. I'm also an Adobe certified Photoshop expert and instructor. Putting photography and Photoshop together and add ingredients of creativity and technique. Voila! My creative albums were born. I have helped hundreds of brides and grooms cherish their memory in style with the help of my albums on their coffee tables. I have put 10 years of creativity and technique into a book to share with my fellow wedding photographers. This book, entitled Creative Wedding Album Design with Adobe Photoshop, is published by Amherst Media and available on major book websites. Years of Photoshop teaching experience has taught me two things that I emphasize in this book. First, the only way to learn Photoshop is by using it. In my book, 10 projects are laid out in great details. Practice files are available on Amherst Media's website for readers to download and to follow the projects step by step. Second, knowing why is just as important as knowing how. In my book, a special unit called What the Wise Man Says, and guess who that wise man is, covers the philosophies of graphic arts, the best practices, and the mechanism behind a technique. Cosmic Journey, a tribute to the many neat ideas of the bride. In this video, I'm going to show you an essential technique that makes this montage cosmic journey possible. This technique is creating layer mask from an image. I'm going to demonstrate how to turn this image of the groom and bride's holding hands into the galactic background of the montage. Here I have created a canvas to the spec of the album page. The holding hand image has been placed on the canvas as a layer. A channel mixer was used to convert the image black and white. Now we will bring in an image of the Andromeda galaxy thanks to NASA's images provided to the public for free. Press V to get the move tool activated. Click and drag the galaxy image into our canvas. As a good practice, double click the layer name and change it to Galaxy. As you can see, this is a rather small image, so we will have to transform it to the right size. You might say this will lead to loss of image quality. You are right, but in this case, it does not matter. We will see why in a few moments. Hit Ctrl T or Alt T on the Mac to start the freehand transform. We will start by dragging the Galaxy to the top left corner, then press and hold shift to maintain the ratio between width and height, while dragging the corner handle to enlarge the image to cover the whole canvas. Next, we will visit a less frequented palette called Channels. In this palette, you will see the red, green, and blue channels of our Galaxy image. What we are doing here is to find a channel with a maximum contrast. As you click on the three different channels, you will see the black and white image of a particular channel. This is kind of like photographing a galaxy in black and white using colored filter on the lens. After comparing the three channels, you will find that blue channel has the highest contrast and provides the most beautiful details of the galaxy. The next few steps are the hard core of the technique. We are going to convert the, this channel into a selection. To do this is rather simple. At the bottom of the channel palette, click on the symbol of the dotted circle. Now look at the image. Rolling ends are everywhere. This is a selection based on the blue channel. White parts are selected and black parts are not. How about gray? They are half selected, of course. 
Now click on the tab of the layer palette. We will now turn off the visibility of the galaxy layer by clicking on its eyeball symbol. What you will see now is this selection on top of the holding hands image. What we are going to do next is to convert the selection into a layer mask. This layer mask will show and hide certain part of hands image and create the galactic look. To do this, first make sure that hands layer is activated. Then click on the create new layer mask symbol at the bottom of the layer palette. The selection has now morphed into the layer mask for the hands layer. Since our background layer is black, any hidden part of hands layer turns black. Want to see our mask? Hold Ctrl or Alt on a Mac and click on the mask in the layers palette. What you see here is exactly the blue channel of the galaxy, but now it is a mask for the hands layer. As I mentioned moments ago, the loss of quality of the galaxy image resulting from upsampling is not important here because it's just providing a sorry pattern for the hands. The conversion between selections and masks is explained in detail in one of the what the wise man says in the book. Applying other techniques demonstrated in the book, you will be able to create this awesome montage that features items significant to the couple's well thought out reception. Creative Waiting Album Design with Adobe Photoshop is available at major bookstores. To order an autographed copy and join Mark Chen's fan club, order from markchenphotography.com.